everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to show you what the Jujube Hobobi looks like, different ways carried on the body. It has so many different options and this bag is fantastic. It holds a ton of stuff, but it's still small enough to wear comfortably around without feeling like you're lugging this massive bag. So I wanted to show you guys three different ways that I like to wear it, or I should say three different straps that I like to use with it, and how you can wear it different ways with each of the straps. If you're interested in seeing how I like to wear it, then please keep watching. All right, so first I just want to show you guys what it looks like with the strap included, and I have it at the shortest length on each side. It has two tri-glides that adjust the length of the strap. The original Hogobly strap is two inches wide and is quite comfortable, but it is pretty wide. So I will show you guys what it looks like. Then you can extend the strap. Now it goes to the longest length here. And you can still just kind of wear it over your shoulder if you'd like. And then you can also wear it crossbody. Now I'm about 5'5 five, five and 150 pounds. It still fits comfortably on me, but I do have a pretty large chest, so it cuts me in kind of an awkward spot. But I would definitely still wear it this way. There's another option that I want to show you guys, so I'll do that now. In order to do that, we have to remove the strap. So I'm gonna take here, as you can see, I'm gonna extend this, I'm gonna loosen the straps just a little bit. And then there's a loop here on the hobo bee and you can scrunch it off to one side and then it exposes the spot where that middle bar splits so you can remove the strap that way and then just pull it through and then you're left with a little d-ring that you can clip a sold separately strap to the first strap i'm going to show you is a long seatbelt strap this is one and a half inches wide which as you can see is narrower than the original hobo bee strap I actually prefer this length when I'm carrying bags. This is just a seatbelt strap that I made, but you can have them made or you can use a different strap if you have one. And then I would normally wear this crossbody and it's actually a little bit too long for me. So I'll probably shorten it just a little bit. And then as you can see, it sits just a little bit lower on my side. It's more comfortable that way. It's not like right up and underneath my chest, which is a little more comfortable. And I love wearing the whole way this way. Now you can certainly shorten this and then just wear it tote style again. So I'll show you what that looks like. In case you're curious what it looks like with a seatbelt strap. Tote style. Now the length hasn't really changed, but I definitely like the way the Hope B looks with a solid strap. I like it with the original Hope B strap too, but sometimes it's fun to have something a little bit different. All right, lastly, I'm gonna show you the same seatbelt seat belt material, but in a hobo length strap. This one is 15 inches long, including the hardware. So I'll strap that on. A lot of people like to hobo their super bees, so this would be a good strap to do that with, but it also works to hobo your hobo bee. <laughs> if you wanna wear it right underneath your shoulder like that. Those are all the ways that I like to wear my hobo bee. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.